you know, I feel great, you know, just like, you know, since everything's over now and I got the win, it just, you know, it makes my life complete. You know, I love doing this, I love getting in there. I'm a competitive man, you know, and I love getting in there, seeing who the better guy is. So, you know, I love it. I just love the feeling. We had a game plan and we did it exactly the way we wanted to do it, you know, it came out, you know, and we just wanted to take it right to the ground. And we thought we had the advantage and we had more than an advantage when we went to the ground. He couldn't even really get me off him at all. I transitioned good, you know, ended up getting his back and flattening him out and, you know, it was a wrap from there. He wasn't getting up. And yeah, I did, I did, but you know, like, he was like a, moving a little bit, but he really wasn't. He was just protecting himself and, but he really wasn't protecting himself, you know? So like, the ref should have called it, you know? Joe's in the corners, talk, talking to the ref, like me and you were talking right now, saying, hey, listen man, he's not defending himself. It's been three minutes, call this fight. But finally when I flattened him out, and my, once I got, once I sunk my hips into him, he wasn't, he wasn't even moving. You know, just, just keeping the straight movement, man, you know, man, just keep staying active, you know, training, you know, man, it's just a great feeling when you get your hands raised, and, uh, and yeah, yeah, I take tough fights. You know, I'm not, I'm not the one to duck anybody. A name comes up, we take the fight. You know, I'm not gonna sit here. I might not be the toughest guy in the world. I don't get the best technique, but you know what? I'll get in there with anybody and see what the better man is. I'm not scared. So we can, we can do whatever you want. You know, and I thought we had a really good game plan this time. Last time, you know, Trump is a very good opponent. He's very good at using his playing. You know, I learned a lot from that fight. I learned a lot from that fight. So you know, just. Keep moving forward, I'm not gonna let it discourage me anything like that. Just keep moving forward, you know, keep getting better, keep moving forward. Man, you know, Joe Joe Lozon is a huge, huge factor in my training. Uh, Jimmy McDonald, Mike Avila, you know, Chris Palmquest, Joe Palmford, you know, and there's a lot of guys that come around and train with us on Saturdays, you know. We just had Donald Cerrone in there, Mickey Gall, we got Rob Fong, we got Calvin Cata, you know. We got Devin Powell. We had a lot of good guys coming, to, and we're all trying to improve and get better. And that's the way I look at it, getting better, is I gotta train with the best, you know? These guys are top, you know? And I'm always, always looking to better myself, and, you know, I, I can't thank more than Joe Lozon, you know? He's always there for me, you know? And, uh, you know, we, we, get, we get the job done, you know? We do, we do it the right way, we get the job done. But huge help from those guys. You know, I love them. They're, we're like a huge family over there, and nothing's gonna change, you know. We're just gonna, that's it. That's, that's my home away from home, you know. I go to the gym.